Hey guys, so today we've got an iPhone 4S which runs iOS 9.3.6 and we will jailbreak it. Without further ado, let's go. So, what you need, 3U tools, open 3U tools and connect your uh, phone to your computer. So, once the uh, once the phone is being recognized from your uh, computer, move forward and uh, go to the jailbreak process. I jailbroke this device before and I left in a drawer for a few days. So I have to do it again. So what you need to do is to go to toolbox and then find the jailbreak click on it and actually on top we'll uh, select uh, phoenix up so uh, once that is selected you have to do one more thing before you go and jailbreak which is to um, Disable your uh, antivirus for this process. Yeah, disable that. And I've got my iPhone for us here. Let's unlock it for a sec and start jailbreak. Here it will ask for your uh, Apple ID credentials. And once you have uh, entered your Apple ID credentials, press OK and let it go and do its thing. So this process is quite easy and uh, you need to make sure that you've got uh, uh, the uh, iTunes downloaded directly from uh, Apple's website, not uh, from Microsoft uh, Store. And before you do the jailbreak, just uh, disable your antivirus and uh, everything will run smoothly as you can see I've got a pop-up on my screen saying let's continue my device and on my device uh, I've got already my Apple ID uh, email so in your case you will see your uh, Apple ID email you tap on it and then you just uh, trust your uh, email yep trust and now that has been uh, trusted now you go to Phoenix app and here you will uh, tap kickstart jailbreak and uh, on this uh, screen you will use provided offsets this one will uh, reboot your device to the jailbreak uh, state so in yeah, as you can see the phone will be will reboot and uh, then it will uh, be jailbroken uh, just bear in mind that sometimes it doesn't do the trick straight away so you have to try one more time but that's all right and uh, this jailbreak the phoenix jailbreak it is a semi untethered jailbreak which means every time that uh, you reboot your device or the device runs out of battery uh, you have to actually open again phoenix up and uh, kickstart jailbreak so the phone is uh, in the home screen i can tell that my uh, phone is jailbroken because uh, on top here i've got this uh, apple logo which uh, uh, i i picked it from uh, the Ze zeppelin uh, repo and my uh, home screen lineup is like so so yep it is just broken and now if i go and open cydia it will uh, load normally so uh, i wanted to ask you guys what's the reason that you jailbreak your devices because personally, I jailbreak a device when it's not supported anymore. And the only reason that I do the jailbreak is just to 
be able to use uh, some apps that uh, natively Apple or the application provider has stopped for the uh, uh, specific uh, iOS version. For example, uh, YouTube is not supported anymore and unfortunately, even though you can uh, spoof the application through um, files and uh, uh, info list, but that doesn't work anymore, unfortunately. However, uh, applications like Facebook, Messenger of Facebook, Instagram, they work just fine. So let's do this uh, upgrade here for a second. It is the Safari Plus, confirm. So yeah, please uh, tell us in the, in the comment section below uh, why you jailbreak your devices. Because it is very good to actually see people, uh, even in 2022, uh, jailbreaking their devices, their old devices. Because as far as I know, there is no available jailbreak uh, for iOS 15, for example. Some say there might be something, but again, nothing stable or nothing uh, official. So uh, regarding this uh, upgrade here that I'm doing, it will take its time because it's an iPhone 4S on iOS 9.3.6. Uh, by the way, when uh, if you have an iPhone 4S and it is on a lower version like iOS 8, please just don't go to iOS 9.3.6 because the, the iOS 9.3.6, it is not a good uh, update for the iPhone 4S. I wish I could uh, stop the uh, operating system to iOS 8.4.1 because on that iOS, the phone uh, feels faster and runs uh, smoother. So this one, it did the upgrade on the Safari Plus and it's back to home screen. So this is it for this video, guys. If you've got any questions or anything, drop them in the comments below and uh, I'll help you out. Thank you very much for watching. And like I said, if you've got an iPhone 4, 4S uh, on an older version of iOS uh, other than uh, iOS 9, do not uh, update it. Just jailbreak it because on iOS 8, the jailbreak, it is uh, untethered. If you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel for more content. Thank you very much. I'll see you later.